What's up, YouTube? Uh, it's my first video uploading on YouTube, and uh, just gotta get some things off my chest. Um, you sports fans out there, NBA fans, um, you know you've heard about you know Chris Paul trade between Lamar Odom and Pau Gasol. Um, <laughs> the owners, um, you know, petitioned that, you know, Chris Paul needs to stay with the Hornets. And now, I guess there's a report saying that David Stearns, uh, you know, he didn't listen to what the owners were saying, yeah, right, about, you know, Chris Paul staying in the, with the Hornets and not going to the Lakers. Now, the trade... I thought was you know was pretty was pretty fair for all all the teams. I mean, uh, you know, the the Lakers would get Chris Paul, uh, the Rockets would get Pau Gasol, and uh, the Hornets. Uh, I think they get draft a draft pick, uh, Lamar Odom, um, Louis Scola, which is a good player. Kevin Martin is still a good player. I think another another player, Dragic or something like that. <laughs> so the owners. Petition and then you know the Cleveland Cavaliers, um, Cleveland Cavaliers owner. Um, I seen he had wrote a, re a letter to the to the um, commissioner, you know, about complaining about this. Of course, the, the Cleveland Cavaliers. I guess they still um, you know broke about LeBron, but whatever. Uh, now the thing I'm I'm upset about is you know who did they petition when LeBron went to the Heat. You know, was there a petition when um, the Celtics traded Ray Allen and uh, to Kevin Garnett? No, those are two all stars, uh, superstars, basically. And uh, thing I'm about, you know, what's the difference in LeBron and Wade in Miami, and Kobe and CP3 and the Lakers? You know, what's the difference in that in that team? You know, I, I just don't get, you know, why all of a sudden they're they're petitioning, um, you know. Basically, you know, just I, I don't I don't know I don't know what to think. Um, I'm I'm still, you know, upset about it. Now they're still talking about that they're gonna work work trades to you know try to get the Hornets more draft picks and stuff like that. You know, <laughs> it's like come on, man. Like the all three of the um, all three of the the teams, you know, they agreed on getting you know that trade done. And, uh, you know, I just think that the owners are just crying, you know, because they, they feel that they're not going to have a chance, you know. I mean, the Lakers had the talent. You know, they, they're still giving up two good players. Pau Gasol is an all-star. He's a, you know, Lamar Odom is like, you know, he, he's an all-star, really. He's, um, he's, he's so good that, man, I, I, I don't know. I, I guess this is just a rant video, um, you know. Tell me what you think about this. I, I just... I think I think it's a good trade, you know. I mean, mind you, <laughs> I think this, this, the Lakers will have a chance, you know, for the next few years, obviously. But I mean, come on, the the Knicks, they they got Amari Stoudemire, Carmelo, you know, might get a, another All Star. They get Tyson Chandler. Um, the Nets, the, uh, I think they're talking about trying to get Dwight Howard. I mean, it's so it still doesn't guarantee the Lakers, you know, dominance over the next, you know, six years or whatever. Um, I, I just, you know, they, they I mean, it's, <laughs> they're talking about, you know, that the small market teams need to get, you know, have a chance, basically. I mean, because, I mean, I mean, the Lakers, you know, they've, they've been good for I don't know how long. I mean, they, they have the, the money, they have the personnel to, you know, to get talent. I mean, they had, they, they have the talent. They, it's not like they're cheating, you know, they didn't, you know, put a gun up to the Hornets and the Rockets, you know, saying, you know, we need to get Chris Paul, but come on, man, this is business. I mean, you got to look at it from both sides. And I, you know, I feel sorry for Chris Paul, you know, he got to go through, you know, he's saying, you know, everybody, everybody's getting what they want. Carmelo got what he wanted. Um, you know, Dwight Howard's probably might get what he wants. Um, it's, it's ridiculous, man. And, uh, you know, I feel, feel for Lamar and uh, Gasol because, you know, they're pretty much going to get traded and they know it. So, you know, why well, go to camp? But it's it's ridiculous, man. It's ridiculous. It's, this is a joke. Um, other sad news. Uh, Brandon Roy, I'm a, I was a big fan of, retired. 
27, his knee, bad knees. <laughs> and then come to find out Greg Oden, yes, Greg Oden. He's, uh, I just read a, um, something from the owner saying that there's a setback on his knee surgery. So they don't know if, if he's going to play this season. <laughs> Like really, another season, man. It's, he's he might be right behind, uh, right behind uh, Brandon Roy. So I feel sorry for Portland fans. You know, I like the Blazers too, but I mean they got a lot of talent. You know, just imagine if Greg Oden and Brandon Roy, you know, wouldn't have those injuries. But you know, I really can't can't dwell on that. You know, it's his sports. You know, everybody's health isn't you know 100% all the time, so they can't be, you know. I don't know, but you know, get it at me. Just rant. this is just a, a rant video. Um, you know, comments, comment what you think. All right, I'm out.